Hey there, Bill West, BarbecueTricks.com. I'm looking over some books, barbecue and even not barbecue, and I wanted to go through like my top 20 barbecue books. And the reason I'm doing this, I just put out the barbecue blueprint available on Amazon.com right now. I wanted to get all my sauce recipes in one place, including my favorite, my own what's this here sauce. Anyway, it's all here available, full color. And uh, actually my secret, I'd get the, get the Kindle version so you can like have it forever on Amazon. Uh, barbecue Blueprint available now. Um, I'm like wearing the same outfit for some reason. <laughs> but here's my top 20 barbecue books. Let's go. Uh, one Pan Man, Nan Kelly put out this book from Great American Country. She did my podcast and I realized she, one of her favorite cookbooks is like a local one that I had never ever heard of. But it, it turns out I think everybody kind of has some local ones. And another recent favorite is this one right here, the uh, Bill Gillespie. Actually, it's a rare one where he talks about how to step-by-step -step do a whole hog. So worth checking out if you're into that. Spent a lot of years in Savannah, Georgia. Mrs. Wilkes went to uh, my church and I have an early connection to Mrs. Wilkes. So not necessarily barbecue, but one of the best, the late great Mrs. Wilkes boarding house. One of my weirdest books, it's How to Cook on the uh, Exhaust Manifold and the Engine of Your Car. <laughs> it's called Manifold Destiny. Good luck trying to find this one anywhere, but uh, might be worth finding out how to do your Hyundai Halibut with fennel. It's in there. A lot of people love this one. Uh, it's ratio, all about different ratios. More science than photos, it's okay. I must have gotten it from the library. Don't know how much late fees I am being charged at this moment, but good one. King of Mexican, so good. Adam Perry Lang does it right. He made a book, really simple, 25 of the most important recipes, and you can literally get sauce all over it because it's made so you can wash it off. Talk about local stuff, uh, all right, local, uh, Nan Kelly mentioned one of her local books. This one in Charleston is a must if you're uh, down about these parts. Charleston Receipts and Augusta Time. Tea Time at the Masters is one that every good Augusta, North Augusta, South Carolina, gotta have it. I guarantee Justin Wilson, always an influence. I'm not as into the science, believe it or not, of barbecue and uh, cooking, but Harold McGee definitely is. He's, uh, this one's super popular with uh, my buddy Jack Weybor and uh, a lot of other people that are really into the science of things. This one is uh, one everybody buzzes about, so it's gotta make the top five. Cooks Illustrated is like the epicenter of tips and tricks, so when they did a compilation of barbecue and grilling recipes, gotta get it, and also well illustrated, not photos, but good uh, information. Hey, talk about photos. Probably has the best photos in this one right here. It is a Williams Sonoma, like everything. They, you know, it looks great. Yeah, kind of a pricey book as Williams Sonoma is, but looks, ooh, look at that, charcoal. Good enough you can eat. This one definitely gets a, a big bonus shout out for some great pictures. And I love this, it's all Traeger recipes, which I love my Traeger. I like the Dean guys, Dean family fan. This one probably would have made my top, but certainly I've had it for a while, but just over the last few months, my number one jumped over it. But Stephen Reichlin is, uh, I mean, I've definitely dug into this book a time or two where, uh, I like it, it's not necessarily glossy photos or anything like that, but it's got a ton of recipes, a ton of good stuff on like the famous barbecue places. Stephen Reichlin has done his homework. And my number one, this one right here, it's the Pat Conroy cookbook. And we just lost Pat Conroy a couple months ago. Famous uh, Prince of Tides author, um, just, it's more story writing, almost more autobiographical than a cookbook, but it still has got so many great recipes. And it's 
So much South Carolina, I thought I'd make that my top pick. You probably have your own. So tell me what your favorite cookbook is in the comments. I would love to hear it. I'll try and put links to find these uh, underneath and on barbecuechicks.com. And of course, one more reminder, get the barbecue blueprint out now. This is the color edition, but my tip is get the, uh, you can get this. You could save about 10 bucks and get the black and white version and get the Kindle version free. So the, the sauce here, I took this picture. It's the what's this here sauce on the chicken. So check that out just for this recipe. Sorry, McDonald's, Big Mac, it's no longer a secret. You can find it online now, www.barbecuetricks.com slash book.